What's up? <laughs> so, I got a question for you. Do you know what this is? That's right. It's duct tape. I have white. I used to have a bunch of colors. But I'm not sure if you guys come across some badass designs and all that cool shit. But I gotta say, I've never really been successful playing around with duct tape. You know? And last night, I don't know, I got bored. I saw the tape, I saw the duct tape, and I had some, uh, some red electrical tape. It's the uh, Pro Series vinyl tape. And they are all duct products. Make sure you use duct products because that's the only duct tape that is worth ducking. Okay? Don't just don't even waste your time with the other shit because it's not going to stick as long. It's going to leave a residue when it come, decides to peel off. It's just bad duct tape. All right. But anyway, I got bored and I looked online, checked out all the YouTube videos, and you know got a general census on how people make their wallets. Um, actually, just to just so I can uh, advertise a little bit here, let's see if we can find her name. How to make a duct tape wallet by So Craftastic. That's S O C R A F T A S T I C. She's actually a pretty good uh, blogger. But, um, no, you know, I looked at a couple other videos on, like, Howcast and uh, Duck Bills, you know, shit like that. And um, I made one. Pretty awesome, right? A little mix of, you know, their design, my design, this design, that design. Fucking everyone's, everyone's made a duct tape wallet before, you know. Like, fucking, there's a million ways to do it, apparently. And I mean, I just finished mine up. It took me, I'd say, about two and a half hours. Not including the detail. But here it is. And uh, I chose to put that on my wallet because I am a blood donor. That's right. O positive. And uh, as you can see, you know, it's regular size of the wallet. I actually have one for comparison. <laughs> this is my old wallet. Leather, you know, and uh, this used to be where my ID went, right here. Right? So I made my wallet, and I did follow uh, So Craftastic's instructions. So that's that was what my actual base template for pretty much the whole thing was. Now I'm just winging it. And inside, as you can see, we've got a lower ledge indoor billfold. Alright? Now, I got three pockets here. You can't really see three of them, but there you go. Three pockets, and it's very simple, and, it, and they're not going to grab onto your cards or anything you put in there. And then, from my old wallet, I got that uh, clear, plastic, clear plastic ID holder. I made a nice little duct tape frame around that, as you can see. Uh, let's see if I can find a card to go here for demonstration purposes. Bam! See, there's my edge card, and uh, a little something I have from a birthday card. Oh look, photos. <laughs> Fit me nice and snug in there, just like that. And that is my duct tape wallet. Now keep in mind, uh, the vinyl electrical tape is not very adhesive, so when using it, be very, very, very precise when you're using it to uh, decorate or add trim or you know seal up edges because it is not very sticky so this is this is a delicate wallet I had to lay a single strip of white duct tape right here just to keep all these or sorry come backwards all these pockets in because this right here was starting to come undone and I actually need to uh, re-edge this edge because so you can kind of see him peeling off a little bit. But that is my homemade wallet duct tape. Hope you guys liked the video and, you know, make one of your own. It doesn't take long. And I'm kind of proud of it. I'm going to have this thing for years. You know? <laughs>